Hello fellow YouTubers, this is Miss 201092 coming at you with a very, very important update. As you guys can see, I have got the big chop. Yes, I chopped off all the current pieces of my hair. Um, I went to New York. I was there for 10 days and I was there um, about three days ago. And I went to this hairstylist. Her name is Miss Diane. I have known her, or she has known me since I was a little child. Um, her hair salon is called Tendrils, T-N-D-R-I-L-S, Hair Spa. It's in Brooklyn, New York, on Fort Greene um, Street, Avenue, whatever. But you guys really need to look her up. She is one of the best natural hairstylists, hairstylists, period on this earth and I just want to shout her out she um, chopped off all the perm pieces of my hair um, did a steam treatment for me so I was able to get it all and I really love the outcome this is a really big update for me because I really didn't know that I wanted to chop my hair so soon I have I was transitioning for nine months and I had a good length of perm here in my head, but I got to that point where it was probably 45% natural hair and 55% perm. It was time for it to go. And Miss Diane told me, when you have close to 50-50, 50-50, and more than 50-50, then it's time to chop off your hair time to start new i have been seeing so many different things with my hair just being cut off one with the perm hair um your natural hair it tends to be weighed down and um i wasn't able to see the full curls of my hair um one of my previous videos i did a mini big chop where i cut off the back pieces of permed hair in the back of my hair and i was able to see my natural curls and i just love them they were so cute and I was like you know I can't wait till I'm ready and I'm comfortable to do it all around most people they set a date and like that's their goal they want to wait two years and a half wait a year wait five months whatever to do the big chop but just know when you're going through this natural journey you really can't set dates you really can't set times it's more of a spiritual thing. It's more of how are you ready to express yourself? Do you want to express yourself transitioning? Or are you ready to, you know, go out there and just do it all, make that bold movement statement with your hair? I have been getting so many compliments, even from God. And it's just like, I can't believe it, you know? And it's not that I need recognition from others, but... It helps, but it has to be from inside. It has to be something that you're proud of. It has to be something that you're ready to do. You can't always look for others to compliment you. You can't look for others to give you that approval like, okay, you know, natural's in, you can do it. But it's more so your decision and are you ready to do it. I want to say when I got my big chop, my mom was a little upset, just a little upset I got it chopped. But I think she's more upset that, you know, I am getting to this age where, you know, I'm making these big, bold decisions for myself. And I do want to say I am proud of myself for, you know, being 19 and just ready to go on natural. I know everybody's like, you know, why'd you cut all your hair off? But it's more so something I wanted to do with myself. I'd rather my hair grow and it's completely the texture that God has given me rather than put chemicals in my hair and, you know, eventually leading to bad health issues later on. Because I've seen that definitely a lot of members of my family, whether it's alopecia or anything like that along those lines, you know, it, it's chemicals. It's going to mess up your... Um, makeup your hair makeup so i'm just gonna sorry i babbled a lot i just had a lot to say but i want to show you guys a 360 of my hair i tried a um what did i try 
a twist out yesterday. I used Jane Carter's Curl Defining Cream. I also use Hair Trition. I have Hair Trition with me here. I use Hair Trition Leave-In Conditioner for moisture. But I feel like I want to um, explore and research about more products. Um, I want a product, if anybody wants to write in my inbox, I want a product that leaves my hair moisturized. Now, the James Carter does do that, and it does define my curls. My curls are great when I put that in. But I need that immediate result. I need to, when I'm ready to go to class, I don't want the white stuff in my hair. Like, I want my hair moisturized, the curls out, right when I put it in. Yeah, maybe I'll wait five minutes, but I don't want to have to go in the dryer, use a diffuser, go out in the air, you know what I mean? Let the windows out just so, you know, my hair could be fully dry and the curls will come out. And then the product, you can actually see the results with the product. I want an immediate um, response. I, or I just want to see it when I put it in. I don't want to have to wait for air to touch my hair to see the results, if that makes any sense. Um... And that's what I've been coming across. Uh, one of the big things that I'm really excited for is just going swimming with my hair. You know, like just going swimming, you know, how it would feel. I'm really excited about that. I know it's not really important, but it's important to me. Oh, and I wanted to show you my outfit. I really like it today. So here's the outfit. Um, I got this shirt from Very 21 in New York. I'm wearing the skinny belt, high-waisted, um, white linen shorts, feather earrings. I also got in New York. It has little metal and pearls. And, um, see my makeup. I'm trying to do something different. Got a little purple in there. And my cherry pink lips. And, yep. So, I hope you guys... Have a great day. I hope you guys like this video. Please leave comments about the products especially. And if any other comments that you want to leave, it has to, doesn't have to deal with the products. Um, thank you and goodbye.